Last year, when Google announced that they were going to get rid of their Google Reader service, I was devastated. I was relying on it completely for my Google Alerts, which I could read within Google Reader without getting all those emails every day. Luckily, you can still get your Google Alerts via an RSS feed and you can pair it with the app Feedly instead. So today I'm going to show you how that works. So essentially what we're setting up today is a Google Alerts dashboard. I'm going, we're going to create a Google Alerts folder within Feedly where you can see all the updates from all your Google Alerts and all the stories that it finds. To do this, you'll need to be logged into your Google account and you'll need to set up a Feedly account at www.feedly.com. So we'll start with Google Alerts. You can see I'm logged into my Google account and then I just need to type in a search query. And as you can see, I put it within speech marks. And the reason that I've done that is I want results that have this entire phrase, Facebook advertising in. I don't want Google to find me results that have Facebook in one section and advertising in the other. We can skip all these steps and go down to where we want it delivered to. Now at the moment it's going to my Gmail account, but I want to click on that drop down menu and choose feed. And now I click create alert. And this brings you into the dashboard for all your Google Alerts. And as you can see, I've got quite a few set up. But the one I'm interested in is Facebook advertising. And I need to find the feed for that alert in order to bring it into Feedly. So if I click on feed here, and what I need is this information, this link right at the top of my browser. So if I copy that, and I go into Feedly, and I click add content at the top. And all I need to do is I need to paste that URL that we've copied from Google. And you can see it comes up here. And I can click on plus. And I can choose where it goes. So firstly I'm going to give it a title. And I can either create a new category so for you, if you're setting up a few Google Alerts, you might call that Google Alerts. Or as you can see, I already have a folder or a category called Google Alerts. So I just check that box and click Add. Now, if I click my Feedly at the top, here we can see there's that category for Google Alerts. If I click the drop down menu, we can see just the Facebook advertising one. And if I want to see it as a list, as you saw at the beginning, I can click on the cog and click title only. So now every morning I can scan quickly through my alerts and I can pick out any stories that might be interesting. And the nice thing is I don't have to go into each folder individually. I can just click into Google Alerts and it shows me all my Google Alerts in one place. 